Hello, in this video, I am going to test the code generation ability of ChatGPT. I will test that for a machine VN code in Python language. What I want is a Python code to detect all circles in an image. Using MATLAB, I found this article that describes a code in MATLAB to detect circles. We will generate the Python code and will feed this image for the testing purpose. So I am asking ChatGPT for the Python code to detect all circles in an image. It has started generating the OpenCV based Python code. It is applying the Huff transform to detect the circle. A couple of parameters are used as param1 and param2. There are proper comments as well. Most of the time, Chat GPT explains the code as well after generating that, but this time it hasn't. No worries, let's ask it to explain the code. So it is explaining about the libraries OpenCV and NumPy. The im read function to load an image. Image conversion to grayscale. And it also tells that it is done because the Huff transform works well on the grayscale. Then how the Huff transform is applied and the different parameters used in the function. It is explaining the param1 and param2 which are used in the canny edge detection. If not satisfied, you can always ask ChatGPT to explain that further. And finally, how the circles are drawn on the image. The radius of the circle and the RGB color which is green to draw the detected circle. Let's copy the code and test that in Python. Here the code mentions the image file name to test the code. I have the image file saved in the working folder. The name of the file is test.png, so I will provide this name in the code. Let's run it. And oh my god, there are so so many false circles detected by the code. Let's play with a couple of parameters like param1 and param2 and increase their values. Param1 from 50 to 100 and param2 from 30 to 60. And yes, we can see it detected 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 circles on the provided image. Isn't this amazing and unbelievable? We got a working OpenCV based Python code in just less than a minute. Let's try different values of these parameters. This time there are false detections. And wow, this time just a few are not detected. That is so amazing. You can play with the parameters to find the best output. A frequent topic of discussion regarding the capabilities of chat GPT for code generation is its potential impact on the role of programmers. Will it eliminate the value of programmers? Well, I believe that chat GPT capabilities are impressive, but currently it does not fully replace the role of a human developer. Like we saw that we needed to tweak a couple of parameters. Moreover, it should be noted that a code generated by chat GPT can sometimes contain errors or inaccuracies. In case of complex large-scale applications and projects, the likelihood of errors in the code generated by ChatGPT may increase. Therefore, ChatGPT can be a useful and efficient tool for the developers because it can provide a starting point for the code and can reduce the need to spend time reading through the documentation, forums and stack overflow, ultimately saving a lot of time and increasing the productivity. For larger projects, ChatGPT can assist in generating subcomponents and speeding up the development process. So I don't see it replacing the developers, but it's a wonderful tool for the developers. It will be interesting to see the capabilities of future versions of ChatGPT. Thanks for your time. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel.